Alrighty, hey, what's going on? Woo, haven't made a video for a while. Tonight is, uh, computer's firing up here. Got 11.56 on a Monday in the p.m., so we're looking at about the 16th of December right now, 2013. Almost 17th of December. This video is not going to go up till after Christmas because this is actually a Christmas gift for a couple of people. But I thought I'd share it with you because I think it's kind of cool. Got some crud on my knife here. So, got this package all the way from New York. It's uh, from Alexandria Bay, New York. So I'll clear across the country. I'm here in Everett, Washington. Just covered up the addresses, so. A little bit of security. Don't remember what I paid for shipping, but it costs $14.30 to ship this thing. These are uh, pretty darn cool. And I'm kind of anxious to see these. There we go. Yeah. Can you tell what they are yet? Bluefoot diving. For, for New York to Fort Lauderdale. So, bluefootdiving.com. These are fossils. These are fossil teeth. These are fossil shark teeth. I wanted some big ones. Mom likes fossils. And I got a brother who's a geologist, not the one that you all know from his YouTube channel, but I got another brother who's a geologist. Looks for an outfit that is kind of environmental type stuff. But I came across these on eBay. I've been trying to win a set on eBay and kept getting outbid. But this guy had a buy it now feature. So. Oh, look at this. These are fossilized megalodon teeth. Imagine the shark that had these in his mouth. That's about where the gum line would have been, so you got some pretty good chompers hanging out there. Let's see if we can get you in closer. I think this is one of the bigger ones. The enamel's coming apart a little bit there, but that is a shark tooth. I don't have small hands. I don't have huge hands, but I don't have small hands, but I thought that would make a neat gift for mom and, and the geologist brother. Like I said, I put a bid in on a few of them and got outbid at the last minute. And I was looking at the teeth I were looking at, they're actually about this size. These are they're a five inch teeth. There's another one. This guy had some cavities. Look at that. No sir, very few serrations on these. Nice coloring though. The real nice ones, the expensive ones, they still have the serrations on the end, they still have a sharp point. I don't know if these are just worn or if uh, sometimes I read a document, watched a documentary, sometimes when they're attacking they'll actually break the tips off, they'll crush them and the teeth will fall out and you won't have the sharp point, but these are pretty worn. The edges of this one are almost look like they've been ground down. You can kind of see the serrations on the edge there, but these are not real high quality specimens, but they are unrestored as well. So those are probably the two five inch teeth, and they measure these things on the long side from the tip to the base of the root. So yeah, so I uh, put a bid in for a few of them, about 90 bucks, got outbid. This guy had all three of his, this came in the group, and he had a buy it now feature of $150. So basically I got down for 50 bucks a piece. And this took care of a couple of gifts then, like I said, for mom and my brother. 
The third one, I'm going to hang on to. Got a couple of nice little stands. And I think this is going to be my tooth right here. I'm keeping the smallest of the three. Well, oh, that's got some nice coloring in it. Wow. That's a nice brown tooth. Very cool. Fossilized shark teeth. Look at those mothers. So yeah, these two, they almost look like they could be from the same animal. They're the same color. This one's a little more yellow. I did pick up a uh, couple of display bases for these two. Let me go grab one see if it'll fit. So hold on a sec. I also ordered three of these. They came the other day from a different, different person. Just a nice little case. Got the Megalodon name on them. Almost like a trophy base. Just like that. How cool is that? Big old shark tooth. Look at the curvature on that, huh? So basically, if you don't know anything about the Megalodons, think of a 60-foot great white shark. That's how big these things got. Now these aren't the biggest teeth. Well, they are big. The largest is a little over 7 inches that direction. Like I say, both of these are supposed to be 5 inch. I don't have a ruler on me. And this is supposed to be like 4 and 5 eighths or something like that. So, very cool. I think Mom, will, Mom and Cliff will get a kick out of that. So, so I'd share those with you guys. Like I say, they're not perfect specimens, but they've probably been... This one's missing a chunk out of the corner there, but... But uh, it will definitely work. It will definitely work. I got a couple other fossils floating around here. I don't know what it is. I got a fish. It's a little, little small fish, you know, a couple inches long, and some sandstone type material. But I don't remember where I put that. It's in a box somewhere, I think. With the cats roaming around, jumping on everything, I try to keep some of the more delicate stuff put away. But. Yeah, I thought I'd just share those with you guys. Hope you all had a Merry Christmas. It's uh, Monday night. I've been working the last almost two weeks straight. So I had to work last weekend. I think I'm off this coming weekend. Hopefully the weather will be nice. Get out and do a few things. Christmas is just over a week away. But this Wednesday will be a week away. So I'll be gone for a few days see the folks and exchange the gifts and all that. And then... Uh, Come back here for a week and goof off, have some time off, and, and then right back into the overtime at work. Oh joy. But anywho, I thought I'd share these with you. I thought that was pretty cool, finding those. Just imagine a big old monster shark coming at you. I'd like to find out what size shark had teeth this size. Although they were bigger at the front of his mouth than they were the back. So I don't know where these would go in the jaw, but... Either way, that's still pretty cool. Alrighty, take the obligatory still photos and get this puppy uh, on the computer. Like I say, I'm not going to put this up for almost a week and a half yet. So, thanks for watching. You all be good. We'll see you next time. Actually, I'll be seeing, you'll be seeing my next video before I put this video up. So, hopefully. Anyway, talk to you all later. Bye-bye.